<laughs> hey folks, how y'all doing? Uh, talking to Smokey Joe today in the Land of Grills. Yeah, we're talking about the handles specifically that we did a modification a bunch of years ago so that you don't have to put your hand on the hot handle there. And uh, we, we started off doing these uh, Nicholson file handles that pick up at Ace Hardware's. And uh, they come in all different sizes. This is one of their smaller sizes. And then I go to the hardware side, hardware department at Ace Hardware, and I get one of these screws and that has wood screws on one side, machine screws on the other side. Then I find a nut that fits and an acorn nut that fits. This whole thing goes together and then goes into there and it works really, really nice. But when you're all said and done, this is about 16 bucks. Now, one of your great subscribers, one, you know, one of you people out there, Lane, and uh, Lane said, hey, Tom, did you see there is a product out there for like eight bucks and it's made by Lava Lock. But when you go on Lava Lock on Amazon, you can't find this thing. They make it for the... Uh, for, for the Weber Smoky Mountain. And uh, so I, I found where the guy finally was able to show me where he found it on, on Amazon, Island Outdoor. And uh, this is how it comes. And we're gonna take a look at it online, folks. This is a real easy mod. It's not wood. That is like a high temperature plastic that's on there. And that, that's really, really, I like the look because it's black and it matches the, uh, matches the Smoky Joe real, really nice. And uh, you know, it just makes things a lot easier. And you put it on the bottom too, and we're gonna put it on the bottom too uh but uh this uh works really good i tell you what let's take a look at it online and then uh just show you how it goes on super simple all right here it is on amazon you can see it is nine bucks eight bucks i said yeah nine bucks total control cool touch damper handle for Weber smoky mountain uh wsm uh blah 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 blah, blah. but it works uh really really nice and it comes just as you see it here it does come with one nut i kind of changed it out and put two nuts on there so i can lock it in a little bit a little bit better but the one nut that it comes with is uh in my opinion just fine so let's put the other one on there and uh like i said this is super simple to do remember if i can do it so can you all right so i just made a decision here jumbo joe and i'm gonna put this on the lid of the jumbo joe i'm gonna leave the wooden file handle ones on the jumbo jaw, you can see I'm using a bigger file handle and I like that a lot better on the bottom. It just, uh, it reaches out a little bit further as opposed to the, the one from Lava Lock. You can see that that one would be way in there. Whereas the file handle one stays out there very nice. So we are going to replace it on the lid here. We'll talk about the diameter and then we'll just install it. All right, so diameter, this is 3 16 You're going to be very careful when you're drilling your hole and you're going to say, Tom, does that void the warranty? Oh yeah, probably. Uh, so you want to use a, a hole punch, just uh, get your hole started there, a good sharp uh, drill bit and cordless drill or corded drill and just drill your hole through the, the aluminum there and uh, you're good to go. All right, there it is all installed. I, I like it. I like it a lot. It looks nice, uh, easy to do. Drill a hole, put it in, boom, you're done. Folks, I uh, <laughs> hope this was helpful. Tom Horseman of YouTube. I, I know a lot of people are going to ask about Where'd you get that from? Uh, so that was from Home Depot many, many years ago. I don't know if you can get this anymore. But on the Jumbo Joe, you have a, your, your uh, daisy wheel is on with a uh, just a wing nut. So I just enlarged the hole to put this in there and then put the, um, put the wing nut back on and it holds both. So it works very nice. Tom Horseman, YouTube, thumbs up, leave a comment. And as always, thanks for watching.